I told you. I told you everything I know. I told you. Mind scan up on screen one, Colonel. Image is present. Image is court. Citizen, I, uh, I abhor torture. But your words just don't match your thoughts. There are clearly details that you're just not sharing. Our little mind reader device doesn't lie. Now, where's Dr. Karina Devonshire? Cordy's going to Still Harbor? She's meeting members of the Resistance. They're giving her the retinal lenses. Helping her out of the country. To Canada. She's with a freedom fighter named Axel. Who has the retinal lenses now? Krebs. William Krebs. How are they getting her into the city? She's had plastic surgery. Your face is changed. You won't recognize her. You'll never find her. You're so beautiful. I'm sorry. Colonel Prizer, executive counsel on line two. Tell him to hold. <laughs> I'm not gonna pander to that mythic name bullshit. Well, Dr. Devonshire still poses quite a problem to the Congressionals. Her escape could jeopardize our strongest defensive action yet. Fully aware of that, citizen. Dr. Devonshire was privy to some of the most sensitive military secrets of the Congressional Republic. Her DNA holds the antidote to our greatest biochemical weapon. She must be captured alive at any cost. I'll take care of your problem, citizen. I'll get my hands dirty for you again. I wouldn't be cleaning up your mess if you'd stopped it from escaping Washington in the first place. <clears throat> well, I, uh... I had no direct knowledge of that operation. Of course, it was a vital part of our contract to Say assure... Say you in. Dr. Corinna Devonshire, Cora D, whatever she calls herself, it really doesn't matter. She belongs to me. <laughs> <laughs> 